All right, guys, now let's take a look at how to use the variables when writing After Effects expressions. Now, what is a variable? Variable is a placeholder, right? In programming, we call it's a placeholder value, right? We uh, keep the values uh, in variables. This may not be clear to you if you don't have a programming background, but uh, I'll explain, right? So to show you this uh, pretty easily, I go to the Visual Studio Code and uh, I'll type like this, right? I'll type uh, A equal, uh, let's say 50 and uh, B equal, uh, let's say 500 like this. And I type the wiggle and I type uh, A comma B, right? So this is the same as uh, if you type, you can type the wiggle and you can type uh, 50 comma 500 right so these uh, both wiggle expression are same right uh, first you can uh let me explain to you let's me let me copy this and paste into the after effects so you can see that so i delete this now we don't have a expression now i click on the wiggle and i paste that now you can see the expression that I have written, right? So a comma a equal 50, b equal uh, 500, wiggle a comma b, right? So now uh, when I apply this, wow, it gave an error, right? So what is the error? Let me uh, explain this to you, right? So after effects uh, expression disabled, error at line three property, position of layer one box uh, reference wiggle is not defined, right? So, right, there is a spelling mistake uh, in this, uh, right, here, right, it uh, should be double G, like this, and now it is correct. Now, you can see, now it is working, right? So, this is the same as, uh, now, uh, you can see how to debug the after effect expression, right? You can see the error message, and you can fix that like this, right? This is a live example. Uh, in that case, uh, we had uh, missed the uh, G letter on the wiggle method. That's why it gave an error. Now, this is the same as the uh, previous one. Let's uh, copy this. And uh, I'll delete this and I'll apply this. You can see it is working same as like this. So we call these things uh, variables. A is a variable, B is a variable. And we add values uh, to the variables like this and then we write the expressions uh, using variables like this practice this technique uh, you will be familiar with the variable there are some uh, complex uh, usages of uh, these variables you might ask hey dude why do we write uh, this kind of uh, three lines uh, because we can write this like this uh, i'll explain this in future tutorials for now let's uh, understand that you can write this expression like this Alright, hope you guys enjoyed the video, like this video, give a comment. Uh